under the screen name Tammy. And Tammy shared a few weeks ago that she had been very violently raped. And she said that that was so traumatic for her that she had decided that she couldn't deal with that pain anymore. She had chosen to end her life. She, she wrote on the site, she said, my nine-year-old daughter loves your music. She listens to you all the time on the internet. She said, we found the broken ones and all different kinds of songs on YouTube and we listen to those all the time. She said, you all are actually going to be in our area very soon. And my daughter's been begging me for weeks to take her to that concert. She said, but when I decided to end my life, she said, right before I was going to swallow the pill, she said, I was leaving my husband a note with the date and the time of your concert on it so that he would be sure and take her after I was gone. She said, while I was writing that note, something prompted me, and we all know what that was, something prompted me to turn on that music one more time. She said, I listened to the song, The Broken One. She said, and this song saved me. She said, I got down on my knees and I gave all of the hurt and the pain to God. And I decided that no matter how broken I am, I'm going to be with my daughter at that concert. Well, a few weeks later in Hodgenville, Kentucky, their entire family showed up. They took up a whole row. And she, as I came in the building that night to go to the product table, I noticed this lady kind of standing off to one side next to a wall. She looked very shy. And uh, I looked at her and I said, Are you Tammy? She said, And I went over and over and talked to her. And she said, This is the first time my family's ever been to anything like this. They came to the concert that night and said goodbye. About a week later, she posted on the site. She said, my husband has never shown any interest in church, gospel music, Christianity. He's wanted absolutely nothing to do with God. She said, our entire family has now begun to go to church every time we We saw them just last week in Somerset. She has now accepted the Lord as her first Thank you all for being a part of this ministry because that's truly what it is. That's not just what I'm saying. 